The second round of the Independence Day Golf Invitational took place at the Ponokina Golf Course in South Jakarta on Friday. The bottom nine players would face the cut. It was a glorious day from favorite George Gandranata, whose lackluster front nine and score of 74 and 2 over par only had him second on the leaderboard along with two other golfers. He teed off just before noon at the 10th hole, ultimately shooting a superb second round of 69, lifting him into the lead at one under overall. But George didn't post the best score of the round. That honor went to fellow professional Fajar Winurianto, whose stunning round of 68 made up for a six over par 78 on day one, lifting him well clear of the cut and in competition for the overall lead. Another player sharing the 11.50 a.m. tea time with George was 16-year-old amateur Kevin Cesario Akbar. After a very disappointing start that saw him languishing in second last at 11 over par after just one round. Day two, however, saw a complete reversal from the youngster and a glimpse of things to come. Kevin carded an even par 72, fully 11 strokes, lower than his Thursday score. That figure was only bettered by George N. Fajar. Nonetheless, it wasn't quite enough to erase his poor opener and he misses the cut going into the weekend by two places. After leading at the end of the first round, Rinaldi Adiando drops to second, but a 73 card to go with an even par on Thursday leaves him in good stead. Fifth place is a split between 15-year-old amateur Tirto Tamadi, who fell from joint second after another round of 74, and Jordan Surya Irawan, who's 73 on Friday, combined with a three over par 75 on Thursday to keep him in the same slot on the leaderboard. Tirto's high-flying performances have earned the youngest player at the event a ticket to the weekend. Other players who made the cut were Joshua Andrew Wirawan and Ian Andrew, who sneaked through by just a single stroke. Florence Armain Blaze Hope, Brita Satu English, Jakarta.